Hello and welcome to my channel. This is take two because once I'd finished this bit, I managed to knock the little water jar over. So we start again. <laughs> the book doesn't come like that. Anyway, let's start again. Have you seen the book edges that I've been doing? That one and that one. Now, how have I done them? Well, we take a book, the bits of wood, two big clasps, jam it in the middle so that it's just like one sheet of paper. Then I get my watercolours, which are on palettes, which I use all the time. I need them marked up and then when it gets empty, I just fill it up out of the bag. So we've got that. I have a brush. There you go. That brush. It's a pro uh, pro art pro lean size eight. We've got that. I've got the said water jar that was there, which I'm not flying, so I'll put it out of the way this time. And what I will do, I'm looking to do in my art book. I've done one that is a mix of colours, no particular order, just a mix of colours. And then the white Uni Posca pen on top. Not a lot, just a bit. So the idea is to get that sort of on the book edge. I want to colour it in the mauves and perhaps the green at the end, because that just worked well. Then I'll dry it. I have hairdresser, hairdresser, hair dryer with me because it needs to be dry, obviously, to put the next layer on. So we'll do that. I think that's about it. So should we get going again? We have one colour on. What I found was that uh, it needed quite a bit of water in the colour. Not to worry, that's not a problem until you knock it over. I'm going to go with this cobalt violet next. Let's try that. Right, so water over there. Just mix myself some up. Now, usually you don't need much on here. But because it's the book, it seems to be really soaking it in. That doesn't look much different, does it, to the first one? Never mind, Lent. Keep going. I'm sure it'll work out. So as it's not that different, I won't go very far with that, don't think. I'll um, change colours. What colour should we have? Let's have um, permanent magenta. That one looks darker, doesn't it? Let's have a bit of that one. Oh, yes, that's a darker colour. Is that going to come out? Yes, you see, that's just slightly darker. As I say. No mad science in this, it's just a case of putting it on as I want it, or as and where I want it. Just to get a bit of different blending of the colours. Let's have a look, and obviously hope that in the end it doesn't bleed through onto the pages. That's not what we want. Right, now... After that, I'm going to do a different dioxin violet. We'll have dioxin, dioxin, yeah, right, something like that. Ah, now that's going to be a different one, isn't it? Let's get some of that on there. Don't worry about it not looking neat because, you know, the joins. Because once you start with your white pen, you can do it in black pen. I just fancy doing it in white pen. Once you start with your other pen, it will match in. Right, now I'm going to break all the rules here and put cobalt green on it. <laughs> just to be completely different. <laughs> see? Just comes out very different on that. Oh, see, that one wants a lot of water as well. It, it doesn't slide. On this it just sort of 
the paint hits the page or hits the book and stays there. There we go, like that. And a bit like that. Let's so, say, experimental video. It might work, it might not. Hopefully it will. It's going to get a bit noisy in a minute when I try and dry some of this off. I might get it all coloured along that bottom. There we go. How's that? Well, we've got it coloured, haven't we? There's a good start. Paints can slip out of the way. Water and brush. <laughs> Get that out of my way. Quick burst of the hairdryer. Sorry about the noise. But we need this dry before we go trying to pen it. Obviously the white pen won't play ball. I wouldn't have thought. How do you know when it's dry? Well, that bit was because that was a bit I did earlier. It's not coming up on the fingers, so looking good. Yeah, see, clear fingers. I'll just make sure it's nice and dry. Yeah, look, nothing. Okay. Gonna risk it? Yeah, let's risk it. Too noisy, Lynn. So what I wanted to do then was something like this. So I want flowers, I want leaves, I want starry bits. Good old shaky a pen. It gets a bit thick and round the edge and everything. I'm gonna get a tissue out just in case he wants to come out too much you just try it. you don't want a big blob of color on this so let's have a look i'm going to i'll tell you what if it stays this white it'd be nice got a bit there might need two coats I don't know how you're seeing me do this, but I uh, don't want the pink there, do we? Let's just, yeah, you have to remind it that you want it white every now and again. So it remembers what colour it should be. Yeah. As I say, we can go over this a couple of times. Just to make sure we got our white in there. Looking good. Wow. I think so. Right, what did I do in the middle? I did dots in there. All right, let's do dots. You're not trying to push through your pages, by the way. You're just doing your dots. Okay, how's it looking? Hmm, a bit different. What else should we do? Let's try that pen again. Um, we have another one? Okay, let's go that way. So we'll start there and they go up there. So that's our main line. This is our like our inside of or middle of the flower with our dotted bits. Yeah. Looks like we need a bit more whiting, don't we, on there. So let's just get another coat on that. to white it up that's a bit better it's a bit more sea isn't it and we want a different leaf on this one clearly so let's bring that one into play shall we how's that different sizes is, is not a problem because clearly flowers are different sizes they have different size leaves This is gonna need another coat of the white. You can see that. Not to worry. How's that? That's quite good. See if we can get another coat on there to whiten it up. Yeah. 
I'm going quiet because I'm concentrating. <laughs> Which is not always healthy. Healthy or he helpful or easy to do. <laughs> Can you see this okay? I do hope so. Are you seeing it come together? On my other one, I'd coloured in the actual leaves in white. I don't think I'd do that here. Um, what I will do is give it just some bits in like this. Just to make it a bit more leafy-like or petal-like. How's that? Hmm. Not very dark, is it? I think we're going to have to double coat these bits to bring them out. Get in there. Almost. Yeah. I like that. What else do I want to do? I had a little man walking and I had stars. I don't think I want those. Um, let's do another flower, a different one altogether. Let's try round. Do we think we'll get round? I've got, I can see white paint on there. So I better clear that up. Let's give that its two coats. How's that? that good. Then what? Well, let's do a different shaped leaf. Like that. You can tell. Talk amongst yourselves while I'm doing this. <laughs> Clearly I've gone a bit quiet. <laughs> Don't worry about it. How's that? Good. Second coat wanted. Don't you think? That's getting me second coat on. The white won't be so bad if it sort of snuck through because obviously you've got white pages. So it's not going to show out like if the colours drained through to the pages. Didn't on the others that the two I'd already done, but then this is a different beastie altogether of what I've been experimenting with. I like to experiment, try different things. Art fascinates me. Okay, what are we going to do with him now? Well, I want a bit of effect, don't we? So I'm going to come like that. You see this happening? There we go. Like that. Like that. I don't know which one I've done that on. Let me do it on that one. Like that. Let's do some like patchwork on here, I think. Ooh, that one's different, isn't it? Do you not like a stem in there, I think? Just a little squiggly one. Yeah. It's different. It's different. That's all we're looking for, isn't it? It's just to be a bit different. We can do a small one over here. Right pen, yeah. I'm going to do little roundy bits on that one. See if it gets stuck in a sort of a line bit, it stops the flow of the pen. Gonna have to go over those ones again, aren't we? As I say, I'm just tapping it out onto the tissue to make sure there's not too much paint on there but there is enough on there paint is it paint posca pen bullet shaped 0 0.7 
white yeah so we get all that i don't know it's not actually telling me what it is perhaps it does anyway let's get our second coating on this little one do need two coats that's for sure before they actually come to life How's that? Whoop. <laughs> it's pretty. I'll give it that. I did like the spotty thing, so I'm going to do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And one in the middle. Yeah, I do like that. Second coat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. It's quite cool actually um mm, 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 i'm not gonna do tricky isn't it <laughs> let's do a see if we can do like this yeah with a flare off of it bit of a second layer so we're going to want some like leaves there, aren't we? Like that one. Do one on this one. Just random little dots. How's that? And a little leaf. Lighten up his stem. A bit more on his dots. There, he's good to go. Whatever it looks like. Um, 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 next. See, I like to do things and colour it and fill it in and what have you. Not of anything in particular, just little bits that I like. Uh, quite pleasing. <laughs> What do you want this end? Mm -mm. I else is in my book? See if I can find something in here. Oh yeah, let's do some leafy things. So we're gonna come down like this. <coughs> it's like reverse, isn't it? It's like you've got a white background and you do colored flowers. Well, I've got a coloured background and I'm doing white flowers. I'm sure it makes sense. Okay, there we go. Very basic drawings. Don't worry about it. It's only your book, so it doesn't matter. Unless you pass it on, of course. It's not a library book, so <laughs> they are our books. How are we looking? A bit more grass there. Yeah, why not? And I think we need something bigger this end to balance it up. I'm going to do, hmm, let's do a bit of a Mandela effort. Like that. Like that. Like that. I'm going to give these another coat, haven't we? Because they're sunken, but now we need the white on them. It's just... That's better, isn't it? Give them their whiteness back. And this one. I'm trying not to make this video too long because of getting it transferred over. Uh, but you can't rush it, can you? Right, what am I going to do here then? But, is it how it's coming? I'm going to do lines there. I'm going to do 
share three bits there. So my lines want rewriting. My circles I want <laughs> recircling. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll think it's a flower, so we'll just give it some bits here in the middle. Stay on sort of a florally theme. Okay, um, do something like this. Okay, that one to that one to that one. Oh, mess this up, haven't I? Just do a load of lines then. <laughs> Nothing set in stone, just. Lots of different lines. How's that? Go over that one. I think we're just about there. Because I'm conscious of the time. Oh, better right, please. Better right on these, please, Louise. I mean, you can take my voice off totally if you like and just watch it through. Me mumbling on. Right, I'm giving in there. Oh, let's put some of my dotty bits. Okay, on there. And it just sort of balances it up a bit more. I'm going to have one of these there. How's that? Why are we done messing now, Lynn? I think so. Let's see if we can get it dry. Hair dryer again. Sorry about the noise. Vince nice. I want to undo it so you can see what it's doing. Coming off here. Bit more. Okay. And what I should say is, while we're waiting for it to dry, do give us a thumbs up. Do subscribe. You know, we're always trying to bring you something new. I'm just desperate to keep the time down. But let you see how this comes out. So. You have your book. Yeah. Has it gone to pages? If we risk it. Oh, there we go. It's fine. Whatever way up you like it. So I do hope you've enjoyed this one. Bit of a nonsense one, but uh, something different for you to do. So stay safe, take care, and I shall say bye-bye for now.